Well, they've starred in campaign ads, have hit the campaign trail, and are definitely stirring up some support on Twitter, but you won't find them on a ballot in the race for 2012. I'm talking about the John 2012 girls, daughters of Republican presidential mm -hmm. candidate John Huntsman. Joining me right now, Liddy and Marianne Huntsman. And what a pleasure to have y'all here. Thank y'all so much for sitting down with me. How are y'all today? We're great. great. It's a pleasure to be in South Carolina. Beautiful. How, how have you guys been enjoying your time so far in South Carolina? It's been great. We, we I got in yesterday from New Hampshire and are here for a couple of days getting ready to come back next week. Busy, <laughs> busy, busy times. Now, okay, mm. you guys are on, you guys are pretty much on the campaign trail. How, mm. I mean, how is it? How, how is the campaign trail for you two? Um, it's uh, fascinating. I mean, it's just been the best experience mm. I've ever gone through, anything my family's ever gone yeah. through. And it's also been great because we've had more family time than we've had in a really long time. We've always lived in separate places, and so now we're always together. It's a family affair. So we're really enjoying it. Now you're missing your sister, Abby. What y'all do with I Abby? Know. <laughs> we, we kept her in New Hampshire. <laughs> made, her, made, her, made her do the hard work. Yeah. <laughs> There's so many of us, we need to spread out, but she's normally with us. So gotcha. next time. Gotcha. Nice. Yes, next time here. I'll have all three of y'all come on. Yes. Now I saw one of your tweets yesterday that you guys actually got switched up with the airport. Oh what gosh. happened? So what <laughs> happened is, um, well, in New Hampshire, you either fly out of Manchester okay. or Boston. And for whatever reason, somebody had told us that we were flying out of Boston the night oh. before. Oh, no. So of course we were so busy in the morning because we did um, the another show, show another mm -hmm. show yesterday morning. I went straight to the airport and ended up at Boston, and I was wow. like, "Why can't we get our tickets out?" And the the <laughs> lady at the counter was like, "You're supposed to be out of Manchester," and I was like, "Well, that's 50 miles away, so we'll yeah. just have to deal with it here." But we made it here, made it. Luckily, which is made the our most important thing. Flights. Yeah, there you go. That's the important part. Yes. Now, tell me a little bit about you guys as as, as children of a candidate. <laughs> what what is it like being a child of a candidate? Because I mean, I know your dad's on the go all the time. Right. So, what's it like? Um. Well, he ran for governor as well. So, um, we've had a little bit of experience, although this is on a much you've gotten your feet higher wet already a little bit scale. Yeah. Um. But you know what? We've, we're just having a lot of fun as a family. It's it's we've made it a family affair. And we're so proud um, more than anything gotcha. to see our dad up there standing up for what he believes in, mm -hmm. and we're so passionate about what he's doing. So I mean, we wouldn't think twice about being on the campaign trail. I mean, we all had our choice to mm -hmm. come on board or not, and all of us just without a question hopped on board. Now y'all are yeah. definitely pa passionate. I've seen your your smoking spoof ad <laughs> that's made its way all over YouTube. You guys are pretty much celebrities yeah. for that one. Yeah. What made you guys come up with that? And did your dad know about that ad before it, no. before it hit the airwaves? This was, I will give this credit to Liddy. Um, <laughs> so you're the mastermind. She, she I'm came more up of with the, the creative. Idea. Um, the creative mind, I guess. That's just how I work. And I come up with visions all the time. Every morning I wake up and they always get shot down. But for whatever <laughs> reason, people were like, okay, my sister's like, all right, well, maybe yeah. we'll attempt at this. It could be something. And so whatever came out is exactly what I imagined in my head. Wow. So I was very happy It's funny about though it. because we actually put it together in a day. Wow. And it's pretty, it's we pretty funny. We had no idea it would go it. this viral, but um, <laughs> you know, we were just having fun and trying to bring some entertainment. Mm -hmm. To what was your? I mean, what was your dad's reaction about it? Like, well, we had told him about our idea a little bit when we were going through the process, and um, he's like, you know what? I trust you girls. Like, it, it sounds like it's you know very heart lighted, you know. So um, we yeah. sent it to him as we were sending it out. Gotcha. <laughs> so you're like, whether you like it or not, actually, it's probably gonna go out anyway. But he was he, he was dying. Us laughing he thought it was hysterically. He thought it was great. Yeah. yeah. Now, what's next for for you girls? I mean. Do any, you know, any three of you, I know your sister's not here, do y'all have any desire to maybe take that run for the White House? No. no. <laughs> Just have that so. like, <laughs> Not happening. I'll save America the grief and I won't run for anything, so. <laughs> what about you, Marianne? I, as of now, no. As of now, okay. No. You guys have, have, so have had think, enough, maybe a we'll little bit? We'll stick together. We'll stick to the uh, YouTubes. The, yeah. We will stick to YouTube. <laughs> gotcha. Well, ladies, thank you so much again for sitting down well, with me. I really enjoyed having us. It's a being pleasure. here. Tell Abby she missed out and we'll have to talk to her. Oh, yeah, time. second round, we, we'll have we her will, here. We will definitely tell her. <laughs> <laughs>